So guys, what I want to do to is I'm just doing a little review on this solar energy kit from eBay. Um, you get a solar panel. These are specifications that it doesn't come with any instructions, but it comes with that. If you can read that. 3 watt solar panel designed working for more than 4 hours after one day of charge. Ok, comes with this solar panel. Um, which gives you the wattage on there. 3 watts, 9 volts. Open circuit voltage 10.8. Maximum system voltage. 1000 volts DC. That's interesting. It does come with the, this, is how you connect it. And I've had to waterproof it, as you can see, the mess of hot glue. Because when I got it, the panel was actually loose. You can see there. And this cable here that goes inside, uh, you could only need to touch it and it used to be pulled straight out. Um, but to be honest, it's, it's not a bad panel. It's very heavy. For, a, for what it is, it's, it's extremely heavy. So you get that, and then you also get this. Now this is the power station. Um, basically you get three plugs on the side as you can see I'm running two light bulbs off it this is what it comes with two light bulbs and I'm just doing a bit of a test on how long it's going to last on the bulbs it's supposed to last for 15 hours on a full charge that's your charge port you plug your solar panel, these are your two lights. You've also got a USB, it does come with a multi port, multi connector USB so you can charge your phone. Turn it on and off like that. Now, let's note there's three lights on here one, two, three. The instant I plugged the two lights in, it dropped down to two bars. Now this has been sitting in the kitchen window for a week charging. It'll only ever get to the top, and the top one will flash, um, and it just continues flashing. So I don't really think this thing is actually getting a full charge. There's nothing not written on it anywhere. Again, I've had to seal this with, I had to take it apart because the battery was loose. These are the two bulbs that you get, and I'm just going to turn it off so you can see. These are the two bulbs. They do come with switches. I've just hung them up here, so but they're a little bit on the dodgy side because they do actually look like 240 volt bulbs, and they do have the 240 volt size screw in. So if you were to plug one of these in by mistake to a 240 socket. Well, I don't know. I mean, hopefully the, the trip would kick in and the power would be cut, but I don't know whether they would explode. They could have designed it a little bit smaller. The same as that is just looks to me like just a standard 240 volt screw in. But there you go. And then they just obviously they screw in like that. And you turn them on. They've all got independent switches at the top. So we shall see how long this lasts. It was five to four when I turned it on. It's been running now for 15 minutes.
still on two bars. Um, so we shall see what we shall see. If they will last 15 hours, I very much doubt they will. From what I've seen, this is a six volt. By the way, it's a six volt battery in here. Um, there's nothing written on anything else. There's no voltage is written anywhere on any of the products. Apart from the solar panel, as you saw earlier, there's nothing written on this. When I took it apart, the battery just got 6V written on it, which I presume is 6 volt. Nothing else. Um, so she will see what happens. This, I think, was £9. £9.99 I got this from Evo. Um, which, if it lasts a long while, a few hours is not too bad for camping, but we shall see how long it lasts.